This is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on how to change the boot order on your computer. Now, the boot order simply refers to the order that your computer looks at when it's starting to boot. So it may be floppy drive A, hard drive C, CD-ROM, USB device, or whatever but it's configured in the BIOS or the CMOS settings. And there are times when it makes a difference. For example, if you're trying to boot a restore CD or install a new version of Windows, you need it to boot from the CD-ROM drive, which means the CD-ROM drive has to be first in boot order. Some users, to speed up their boot by a few seconds, will change the boot order so that the hard drive is first and that way the system doesn't look at the floppy drive or CD-ROM drive as options for possibly booting. So we're going to look at the BIOS. Keep in mind before we even get started I want you to know that you don't have to be afraid of the BIOS. You access it just as your computer boots. It will show on your screen. Press delete to enter setup, press, press F2. It varies from computer to computer, but it always shows on the screen what key you need to press to enter setup. And by setup, they're referring to the BIOS or CMOS. So remember, you can't hurt anything, and we're going to take a good look at it right now. So your computer starts to boot. You see, press delete to run setup. Press that. You go into the CMOS. Now CMOSs are pretty much the same, but some of them are laid out different. This one has a menu going across the top. Main, Advanced, Power, Boot, Security. Highlight Boot. You're looking for Boot Device Priority, Boot Order. You see it shows First Boot Device is CD-ROM. If it doesn't say that, then you change it. This type of BIOS here is different, has standard CMOS features, advanced BIOS features, but you're looking for the ability to change the boot order, the boot priority. So you go in there, you see first boot device, CD-ROM, second boot device, floppy, third is the hard drive. You can change it so that you have whatever you want to be first, first. CD-ROM, hard drive, whatever. When you're done in CMOS, you simply press F10. That's pretty much universal in CMOS. Some, you'll press Escape. So that's changing the boot order, and that's all there is to it. 